is on for South Africa's next gospel sensation. 150,000 rand to be won. One lucrative recording contract to be signed. Only one aspirant gospel singer can walk away with this grand prize. Who will it be? Join us tonight as many hopefuls from around the country say, I want to sing gospel. Taking it back to the heart of things, Sanbonane Makaya doing it heritage style today. The wildcat campaign for this season culminates tonight. One of our six eliminated contestants will be making a comeback. You have voted and the eliminated contestant with the highest votes will be revealed and the recording contract as well as the 150,000 rands cash prize will be within his or her grasp once again. And this year there's also a tour of significant Christian sites in Israel up for grabs, sponsored by Bridges for Peace. Since last Sunday, you've been voting for your favorite top four contestant to be safe from elimination tonight, and you've been voting for your favorite eliminated contestant to return to the competition. Who's making a comeback and who's making an exit tonight? Because only four contestants remain. We don't have a bottom three tonight, but we have a bottom two. So Linda Lan and our guest judges' scores will determine whom out of the bottom two will be hanging up their microphones for good tonight. They really have a difficult task ahead. And on that note, let's meet the brave guest judges who've taken on the challenge. Sitting to the right of Mr. Mkiza is multi-award winning gospel diva whose music ministry spans an amazing 11 years of uplifting gospel hits. Please help me welcome Winnie Mashaba. We also have the man himself, Mr. Aubrey Gado, gospel crew nine, platinum selling gospel star, is Pastor Soli Vashagu. I get kids and John Bubu and us shang in your jail. We are born in a buffet to the pie, my die, yeah, yeah. Yeah? I know I'm born in the middle of the Mukoku election. What's happening tonight? <laughs> oh, yeah, tonight we're actually giving a second chance to one of the eliminated contestants. They're quite excited. But uh, it's crunch time for the four remaining contestants. One is going home. Now I can say that. So the match carries on the competition in the top four. It's still very, very tough. But what's the theme for tonight? I mean, do I need to ask? Oh, yeah. I mean, look at the way we are dressed today. It's, uh, it's Heritage Month in South Africa, so we are celebrating who we are. Traditional music tonight in, uh, presented in our gospel way. In our gospel way. Well, you heard from the man himself. The top four contestants and the one wildcard contestant will perform for our judges tonight, and one of the top four will have to hang their microphone as the selected wildcard candidate makes a re-entry into the competition. And with that, let us welcome our current top four. Come on out, guys. He's in the house, ladies and gentlemen. It's Vuselelo Khatebe. Make some noise for Malcolm Edward. Put those hands together for Ntagani Botele. And last but not least, we have Tabani Ngube. Now, ladies and gentlemen, let us welcome our wildcard candidates. Come on out. It's Nosi Popiri. Nobile Ngiti. Sam Galisiwa Mvelase. Nonsigelelo Shandu. Nombulelo Chefu. And Tando Macapela. The moment of truth, ladies and gentlemen, has arrived. The moment you all in the front have been waiting for. Last week, we asked you to vote for the eliminated contestant you would like to see come back into the competition. You voted, and your votes have been tallied. The name of the person who's coming back into the competition to try and gain the favor of our judges tonight is right here in my hand. And that honor 
goes to. The contestant who will be announced after the break. Stay tuned. <laughs> Welcome back. Before the break, we met our remaining top four contestants, but there will be five performances tonight. Well, the fifth spot goes to the eliminated contestant who received the highest number of wildcard viewer votes after last week's performance. All six wildcard candidates rehearsed, but only one will get to sing their song. Who will it be? Let's find out. That lucky contestant who gets to perform their song tonight. Out of the six of you, the candidate who has the honor of performing for viewer votes tonight is Sam Gelisio and Velasa, congratulations! You join the rest of the top four! Sam Gelisio, congratulations, well done. You can go up and join the rest of the top four. You deserved it, you earned it, the viewers liked you at home, and they brought you back. Which means the rest of you guys, this is uh, the end of the road for you. Unfortunately, you've been great, we love you, and thank you for coming back. Take your final bar, come on. Yeah, always sad to see someone leave the competition, someone's journey in this competition coming to an end. But as we all know, there only has to be one winner. And so the competition carries on. Sam Gelisiwe, you will be singing for viewer votes tonight, along with two of the guys who are in the top four who are safe tonight. We now have a tough top five once again, but by the end of this show, we will only have four remaining. Who is saying goodbye tonight? Well, the judges' scores will tell, but I can tell you who is not going to be by virtue of receiving the highest number of viewer votes after last week's performance. When I call your name, please step forward. Tabani. And Vusele. You two sang for viewer votes last week. Time to find out what the viewers have said. Unfortunately for you, you guys did not get the highest number of viewer votes, which means you are in the bottom two tonight. You will be singing to save your microphones. Congratulations to the two of you. You are safe, and you get to be with us again next week. And with that, let the music begin. As you've heard, all the contestants were asked to prepare a song that represents their heritage. We start with Tabani, and he'll be singing a song called U Namanza U Jehovah. Before he does his thing, here's what he had to say about the song. The heritage is as a imvela piyami as umundo umyama as utlang puma kona ekaya ngi kuli swaganja. Ito le engi chuzile ito le litu U Namanza U Namanza U Jehovah. Over a traditional song, or we told the Elikombisa in Villa Pia Milan Puma Corner, Ekaya, Sisakula Dala, the Xin, so 
So it represents the heritage.